Use English here and now. Let's do something new. Use the English inside you. Let's do something new. Speak up and just be you. Show the world what you can do. A Kaiwa time trial. Let's get started with day 11 for the month of May. Hi, Hi everyone. everyone. I'm Steve Ceresi. And I'm Jenny Skidmore. Thanks for joining us. All right. Before we begin, I have a question for you. How was your weekend? Good. Jenny, how was your weekend? It was pretty good, Steve. How about you? How was your weekend? I was busy this weekend. I cleaned out one closet, and there were a lot of magazines. So I got some string, and I tied up the magazines, and I threw them away. All right, this week, from Monday to Thursday, we have our skill tests. And today's SPR skill test is based on this month's basic phrases. That's right, we have 10 phrases. And we'll try those phrases two times. Try to say something each time. And today, our skill test will be in almost all English. Are you ready to get started? Then let's go! S P R Skill Test. I'll say a phrase in Japanese and you express it in English. Say it in English. And the next one was about mountains. Kirei na yama desu ne. Go ahead. All right, here's the next one. Sono jeans ii desu ne. Doko de kattan desu ka? Nibun wo ikki ni dozo. Next, let's try these two sentences. その富士山 T シャツいいですね。日本に行ったことがあるんですか ?OK、okay,、Here's the next one。何かお困りですか ?Here's the next one。今からお祭りに行くんですか Okay, next. お祭りに行ってきたんですか？お祭りはどうでしたか？ Okay, two more. それは誰の銅像ですか？ Use the word statue. Go ahead. Here's the last one. 兄弟はいますか ?Okay, time's up. Did you try to say each one? That was your first try. Now, Jenny will give you some sample answers. And after that, we'll try this skill test together one more time. So now you can check your answers with mine. And if you have our textbook, you can follow along there too. So listen closely. Fun amusement park, isn't it? Yuenchi is amusement park. And the important point is this is a way to start a conversation. Repeat this one after Jenny. Fun amusement park, isn't it? Kirei na yama desu ne. Beautiful mountains, aren't they? This one was the plural. Mountains. So the ending was, aren't they? If you're talking about one mountain, for example, Mount Fuji, it would be singular. Beautiful mountain, isn't it? Either one is okay. All right, here's another way to start a conversation. Sono jeans ii desu ne. Doko de kattan desu ka? I like your jeans. Where did you get them? I like your jeans. Where did you get them? Making two sentences is a very, very important skill. It helps with communication. 相手に通じる確率がぐんと上がります。
その富士山 T シャツいいですね。日本に行ったことがあるんですか ?I like your Mount Fuji T シャツ。Have you ever been to Japan? Or have you ever visited Japan? Okay, here's the next one. 何かお困りですか Do you need some help? This is the standard way to offer someone some help. You can also say, May I help you? But that's usually what someone at a store says. 困っている人に声をかけるなら Do you need some help? Repeat this one after Jenny. Do you need some help? Here's the next one. 今からお祭りに行くんですか Are you going to the festival now? Are you going to the festival now? お祭りに行ってきたんですか Did you just come from the festival? Did you just come from the festival? ちょうどお祭りから帰ってきたところですかということですね。Repeat after Jenny. Did you just come from the festival? Here's the next one. お祭りはどうでしたか How was the festival? Did you say it in the past tense? How was the festival? それは誰の銅像ですか Who is that a statue of? Who is that a statue of? 兄弟はいますか Do you have any brothers or sisters? Okay, those are some sample answers for today's skill test. Let's try these phrases one more time today. This is your chance to do even better than before. So I'll say it in Japanese and you say it in English. And I'll say the sample answer after you. Okay, do your best. Let's go! 楽しい遊園地ですね。Fun amusement park, isn't it? きれいな山ですね。Beautiful mountains, aren't they? そのジーンズいいですね。どこで買ったんですか I like your jeans. Where did you get them? その富士山 T シャツいいですね。日本に行ったことがあるんですか I like your Mount Fuji T シャツ。Have you ever been to Japan? 何かお困りですか Do you need some help? 今からお祭りに行くんですか Are you going to the festival now? お祭りに行ってきたんですか Did you just come from the festival? お祭りはどうでしたか How was the festival? それは誰の銅像ですか Who is that a statue of? 兄弟はいますか Do you have any brothers or sisters? Okay, time's up. Well, how did you do? Did you remember those basic phrases we worked on this month? So keep practicing, and your speaking skills will get better day, day by day. day. This month's theme is Getting to Know You. Tomonachi ni naro. Bangumi no text ni wa kai set ya ni hongo yaku. So ste e kai wa ni yaku datsu boku kara no advice mo not te i m a s yo. Ren shu chou toste mo katsu yo ste kudasai. So, see you next time on Eikaiwa Time Trial! Bye bye!
English here and now. Let's do something new. Use the English inside you. Let's do something new. Speak up and just be you. Show the world what you can do. A car walk time trial. Let's get started with day 12 for the month of May. Hi, everyone. I'm Steve Ceraci. And I'm Jenny Skidmore. Thanks for joining us. This week, from Monday to Thursday, we have our... Skill, skill tests. tests! And today's SPR skill test is based on this month's advanced phrases. We have 10 phrases, and I'll say them in Japanese first. And then, you express them in English. We'll try this skill test two times today. And today, our skill test will be in almost all English. But you know our format, and it's easy to follow. Are you ready for your first try? Then let's go! S-P-R Skill Test I say something in Japanese, and you express it in English. Here's the first phrase. Koko no tempura wa ikaga desu ka? Nihon wa ikaga desu ka? Here's the next one. Donna shigoto shiteiru desu ka? Chiisa na yakkyoku de hataraite imasu. Soumubu de hataraite imasu. Use the word administration department. Go ahead. Here's a long one. Intai shite imasu ga, byouin de volunteer o shite imasu. Go ahead. Here's the next one. Mukashi wa hoken gaisha de hataraite imashita. Okay, here's the next one. Watashi wa shufu desu. Go ahead. Here's the next one. Okay, there are two more. Musko san no oko san wa nansai desu ka? Let's try this one. Shitsurei desu ga, go ryoushin wa ima o ikutsu desu ka? Okay, time's up. Did you try to say each one? Those were some advanced phrases. So now, let's check some sample answers, and I'll give you some advice. And after that, we'll try this skill test together one more time. So now you can check your answers with mine. Here we go. Koko no tempura wa ikaga desu ka? How do you like the tempura here? How do you like the tempura here? How do you like is a good question. Do you like yori how? Nihon wa ikaga desu ka? How do you like Japan? Here's the next one. Donna shigoto shiteiru desu ka? What do you do? What do you do? Or a longer way of saying it is What do you do for a living? What do you do for a living? Now let's check some replies to that question. For example, I work at a small pharmacy. Yakkyoku, pharmacy. You could also say drugstore. Either one's fine, but the important point is to use it in a sentence. I work at. And the next one has I work in. Let's check it out. I work in the administration department. I work in is used in two ways. First, for a department, nani nani bu, and the second way, nani nani kanke. For example, I work in education. Jenny, you work in education as well. That's right, and I also work in entertainment, and you do too, Steve. Am I an entertainer? <laughs> I've seen you on TV. Oh, thank you for reminding me, Jenny. <laughs> 
Well, let's get back to some education. Here's the next one. I'm retired, but I volunteer at a hospital. I retire ではなくて I'm retired が定番です。And then I volunteer at a hospital. Here's the next one. 昔は保険会社で働いていました。I used to work at an insurance company. 保険会社 is insurance company. I used to work at an insurance company. Okay, here's the next one. 私は主婦です。を英語で表現してみると I run my household. 家を切り盛りしています。I run my household. Here's another way. I'm a stay at home mom. I'm a stay at home dad. Stay at home mom, dad. 息子さんのお子さんは何歳ですか How old are your son's children? How old are your son's children? 失礼ですが、ご両親は今、おいくつですか If you don't mind my asking, how old are your parents now? If you don't mind my asking, 決まり文句ですね。How old are your parents now? Well, did you understand those sample answers? All right, now it's your turn to try one more time. And this is your chance to do it even better than before. Let's go. ここの天ぷらはいかがですか How do you like the tempura here? 日本はいかがですか How do you like Japan? どんな仕事をしているんですか What do you do? 小さな薬局で働いています。I work at a small pharmacy. 総務部で働いています。I work in the administration department. 引退していますが、病院でボランティアをしています I'm retired, but I volunteer at a hospital. 昔は保険会社で働いていました。I used to work at an insurance company. 私は主婦です。を英語で表現してみると。I run my household. Or, I'm a stay at home mom. I'm a stay at home dad. 息子さんのお子さんは何歳ですか How old are your son's children? 失礼ですが、ご両親は今、おいくつですか If you don't mind my asking, how old are your parents now? Okay, time's up. Did you remember those advanced phrases this month? Okay, let's finish up by making an original question How do you like? All right, Jenny, you try. How do you like Tokyo? That's a good one. How do you like? Okay, now it's my turn. How do you like this hot spring? Oh, that's a nice one. Now you make a question. Ready? Start. Good. Our theme is getting to know you, so we practice some good questions. And you can have some good conversations. So keep practicing, and your speaking skills will get better day, day by day. day. So see you next time on Aikaiwa Time, time Trial. Bye bye.
here and now. Let's do something new. Use the English inside you. Let's do something new. Speak up and just be you. Show the world what you can do. A Kaiwa Time Trial. Let's get started with Day 13 for the month of May. Hi, everyone. I'm Steve Ceresi. And I'm Jenny Skidmore. Thanks for joining us. This week, on Wednesday and Thursday, we have a special kind of test. It's a Taiwa Karaoke skill test. Today is the basic version of Taiwa Karaoke skill test. But first, let's warm up with a question. Let's warm up! All right, here's a question from today's conversation. Do you live near here? So first, try to answer in your own words. Do you live near here? Go ahead. All right, now let's check some sample replies. Do you live near here? Number one. Yes, I live near Higashi train station. You can use that reply and put in your local train station. I live near Nani Nani train station. Number two. Yes, I live in a place called Higashimachi. You can use that phrase. Just put in the place where you live. I live in a place called Nani Nani. Number three. Yes, I live in a condo near the next bus stop. All right. The way to answer is to say yes and then add one sentence. You can use the sentences that Jenny introduced, or you can make your own. Now, here's the question one more time. Do you live near here? Go ahead. Okay, now you're warmed up. So let's have a conversation over the radio. Taiwa Karaoke Skill Test Here's the scene for today's Taiwa Karaoke Skill Test. You're at a bus stop near your house. And look who's next to you. What time is the next bus? So, you're going to start the conversation today at a bus stop. Are you ready for a six-turn conversation? Then let's get started. 困ってる人に話しかけましょう。どうぞ。Oh, thanks. What time is the next bus? 自分なりに返答してください。どうぞ。Great. Thanks. 相手は野球の応援グッズを持っています。今夜の試合に行ったか聞いてください。どうぞ。Yeah. 日本を旅行中なのか、それとも日本に住んでいるのか聞きましょう。We live in Japan now. We moved here around Christmas last year. どこから引っ越してきたのか聞きましょう。We're originally from Seattle, and my wife got transferred to Japan. Do you live near here? 自分なりにどうぞ Okay, time's up. Did you take the lead in the conversation and ask some good questions? では、ジェニーさんと僕でこの会話をしてみます。So pay attention to how Jenny takes the lead. She asks some good questions. And if you have our textbook, you can open it up and follow along. So this time, I'll start the conversation and I'll ask some good questions. So listen closely. 困ってる人に話しかけましょう。Do you need some help? Oh, thanks. What time is the next bus? 
I think it's coming soon, in two or three minutes. Great, thanks. 相手は野球の応援グッズを持っています。今夜の試合に行ったか聞いてください。Did you go to the baseball game tonight? Yeah. 日本を旅行中なのか、それとも日本に住んでいるのか聞きましょう。So, are you visiting Japan or do you live here? We live in Japan now. We moved here around Christmas last year. どこから引っ越してきたのか聞きましょう。Where did you move from? We're originally from Seattle and my wife got transferred to Japan. Do you live near here? Yes, I live in a condo near the next bus stop. Okay, did you understand our conversation? Let's review some of the phrases and questions that I used. Do you need some help? You can use that in many situations. The next one was about the next bus. What time is the next bus? Jenny さんは I think it's coming soon, in two or three minutes. 二三分後っていう言葉もありました。In Two or three minutes. After, later, ではなくて in はよく使います。In two or three minutes. 次に相手の様子からこのように質問しました。Did you go to the baseball game tonight? 一回ジェニーさんの後に行ってみよう。Did you go to the baseball game tonight? そしてその後、日本を旅行中なのか、それとも日本に住んでいるのかを聞きましたか So, are you visiting Japan or do you live here? Where are you from? いきなり聞くよりも、まずこちらを聞いてみてください。一回ジェニーさんの後に行ってみよう。Are you visiting Japan or do you live here? 次に、どこから引っ越してきたかその質問は、Where did you move from? Where did you move from? ジェニーさんの後に行ってみよう。Where did you move from? All right. 最後にもう一度トライしましょう。Okay, let's have this conversation one last time. This is your chance to do even better than before. Ready? Start! 困ってる人に話しかけましょう。どうぞ。Oh, thanks. What time is the next bus? 自分なりに返答してください。Great, thanks. 相手は野球の応援グッズを持っています。今夜の試合に行ったか聞いてください。いや、日本を旅行中なのか、それとも日本に住んでいるのか聞きましょう We live in Japan now. We moved here around Christmas last year. どこから引っ越してきたのか聞きましょう。We're originally from Seattle, and my wife got transferred to Japan. Do you live near here? Okay, time's up. Well, how was your final try at today's conversation? Your conversation skills are getting better day, day by day. day. This month's theme is Getting to Know You. Tomonachinaro. 練習帳としても活用してください。So, see you next time on 英会話タイムトライアル。バイバイ
And now. Let's do something new. Use the English inside you. Let's do something new. Speak up and just be you. Show the world what you can do. A Kaiwa time trial. Let's get started with day 14 for the month of May. Hi, everyone. I'm Steve Ceresi. And I'm Jenny Skidmore. Thanks for joining us. Today's our final step for the skill tests. It's our Taiwa Karaoke skill test, Advanced. Advanced. So let's have a full conversation over the radio. Taiwa Karaoke skill test. Here's the scene for today's Taiwa Karaoke skill test. You're waiting at a bus stop near your house. And you offer some help. And after that, you ask some questions to have a good conversation. You'll get to know someone at a bus stop. Okay, get ready to take the lead in the conversation. So, do your best. Let's go! Oh, thanks. What time is the next bus? Great. Thanks. Yeah。野球の試合について感想を聞きましょう。Well, it was pretty good, but a little long. My son fell asleep in the middle of it. 一緒にいる相手の息子さんが野球をやっているかどうか聞きましょう。yeah, he doesn't belong to a team yet, so we play a lot at home. James just turned six. He's starting elementary school soon. Nihongo We live in Japan now. We moved here two weeks ago, actually. We're originally from Seattle, and my husband got transferred to Japan. Do you live near here? Oh, what a coincidence! Actually, we live near there too. Maybe we'll see you again sometime. Okay, time's up. How did you do? In today's conversation, there were some new parts. So I'll have the conversation with Jenny now. Just listen to how Steve makes the questions and use them as a hint. And if you have our textbook, you can follow along there too. Listen closely. Do you need some help? Oh, thanks. What time is the next bus? I think it's coming soon, in two or three minutes. Great, thanks. 相手は野球の応援グッズを持っています。今夜の試合に行ったか聞きましょう。Did you go to the baseball game tonight? Yeah. 野球の試合について感想を聞きましょう。How was the game? Well, it was pretty good, 
but a little long. My son fell asleep in the middle of it. 一緒にいる相手の息子さんが野球をやっているかどうか聞きましょう。Does your son play baseball? Yeah, he doesn't belong to a team yet, so we play a lot at home. 息子さんが何歳かここで聞きましょう。How old is your son? James just turned six. He's starting elementary school soon. 日本を旅行中なのか、それとも日本に住んでいるのか聞きましょう。So, are you visiting Japan or do you live here? We live in Japan now. We moved here two weeks ago, actually. どこから引っ越してきたか聞きましょう。Where did you move from? We're originally from Seattle. And my husband got transferred to Japan. Do you live near here? Yes, I live near Higashi train station. Oh, what a coincidence! Actually, we live near there too. Maybe we'll see you again sometime. Yeah, maybe I'll see you again sometime. Well, did you understand our conversation? So now let's have this conversation one more time. This is your chance to have an even better conversation than before. Okay, let's go! 家の近くのバス停で困ってる様子の人がいます。話しかけてください。Oh, thanks. What time is the next bus? 自分なりに返答してください。Great. Thanks. 相手は野球の応援グッズを持っています。今夜の試合に行ったか聞きましょう。Yeah. 野球の試合について感想を聞きましょう。Well, it was pretty good, but a little long. My son fell asleep in the middle of it. 一緒にいる相手の息子さんが野球をやっているかどうか聞きましょう。Yeah, he doesn't belong to a team yet, so we play a lot at home. 息子さんが何歳かここで聞きましょう。James just turned six. He's starting elementary school soon. 日本を旅行中なのかそれとも日本に住んでいるのか聞きましょう。We live in Japan now. We moved here two weeks ago, actually. どこから引っ越してきたか聞きましょう。We're originally from Seattle. And my husband got transferred to Japan. Do you live near here? 自分なりに答えましょう。Oh, what a coincidence! Actually, we live near there too. Maybe we'll see you again sometime. Okay, time's up. Well, how was your final try at today's advanced conversation? Today and this month, we learned some phrases and techniques for getting to know someone. Yuki o dashte, irona shito to e kai wa o j i s a i ni s h t e m i m a s h o Your conversation skills are getting better day by day, week by week, and month by month. This month's theme is Getting to Know You. Tomo nachi ni n a r o So, see you next time on A Kaiwa Time Trial. Bye bye!
English here and now. Let's do something new. Use the English inside you. Let's do something new. Speak up and just be you. Show the world what you can do. A Kaiwa time trial. Let's get started with day 15 for the month of May. Hi, everyone. I'm Steve Ceraci. And I'm Jenny Skidmore. Thanks for joining us. Today, we have a special version of our 10-second challenge. Okay, let's get started. 10-second challenge in the U.S. 10-biao challenge in the U.S. Steve interviewed people in the U.S. That's right. America で街行く人に問いかけて、10秒で答えてもらいました。ネイティブはどのように返答するのか聞いてみましょう。Today we'll check out three people's replies. 今回のテーマは Tell me about one friend. 友達一人についてとても楽しい返答してくれた人もいましたよ。そして、Listening だけではなくて皆さんも最後にこのクエスチョンにチャレンジします。Tell me about one friend. Alright, let's check out what some people in the US had to say and you can use their replies as a hint. それではまず一人目です。The first person I interviewed was Pam. I met her in a quiet neighborhood. She's originally from California, and she used to work at a hospital. And she told me about a friend who she worked with at the hospital. Okay, here's my question and Pam's 10-second answer. Tell me about one friend. Ready, start. My best friend's name is Sharon. She's a wonderful lady. She loves to help people. And... She always had long, blonde, blonde hair, and she was very tall and gorgeous. Oh, that's such a nice thing to say about your friend. It sounds like they have a great friendship. 10秒を少し超えてしまいましたが、最後まで言い切ってくれましたね。それでは、内容をチェックしましょう。まず、Pam さんが、My best friend's name is Sharon. 名前を伝える文でしたね。そして、She's a wonderful lady. She's a wonderful lady. Do you f e e wonderful かっていうと She loves to help people. She loves to help people. そして次は外見についてです。And she always had long blonde blonde hair. And she was very tall and gorgeous. Okay, that's one way to describe a friend. Pam talked about her personality and then she talked about her appearance. Let's check out Pam's reply one more time. Here it is. My best friend's name is Sharon. She's a wonderful lady. She loves to help people. And she always had long, blonde, blonde hair. And she was very tall and gorgeous. 先ほどより聞き取りましたかこのように難しい単語を使わなくても内容の濃い返答ができるんですね。続いて2人目です。The second person I met is Pam's husband. His name is Dave. He works in finance. 金融関係の仕事をしています。そして、週末は海のスポーツをやっています。Okay, let's have some fun as we check out how Dave replied. Tell me about one friend. Go ahead. Yeah, every Sunday I go scuba diving with a couple of mermaids, and they're beautiful. And they take me to places you only dream about. <laughs> <laughs> well, Dave has quite an imagination. So let's check Dave's reply now. Yeah, every Sunday I go scuba diving with a couple of mermaids. Mermaids in Japanese is ningyo. 実際にデイブさんはどうやらスキューバダイビングのインストラクターだそうですが、そこ一言で終わるのではなくて、次は、They are beautiful. They take me to places you only dream about. 夢でしか出てこない場所に連れてってくれます。So now, why don't we check out Dave's very creative reply one more time? Here it is. Yeah, every Sunday I go scuba diving with a couple of mermaids, and they're beautiful, and they take me to places you only dream about. <laughs> Thank you, Dave. ではもう一人の返答を聞いてみましょう。3人目は前回の10 second challenge in the US にも登場してくれました。デビーさんです。彼女はメディア関係の仕事をしています。She works in the media. 
And she's from Washington, D.C. Debbie さんは旅、travel が大好きなようですよ。Okay, here's Debbie's reply. Tell me about one friend. Ready? Start. Well, I have a friend named Rose.、Um, she flies an airplane and she takes me on the grandest adventures, and I love it because I get to travel all throughout the skies, which is one of my favorite things to do. Okay. Well, Rose sounds like a great friend to have. <laughs> a friend who flies an airplane. Scotty, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to go to the next one. Well, I have a friend named Rose. 彼女は何をしているかというとこの次の文です。She flies an airplane. 彼女は飛行機を操縦します。She flies an airplane. そして、And she takes me on the grandest adventures. 私を最高に壮大な冒険、アドベンチャーに連れて行ってくれます。そしてその次の文は、And I love it. 私はその旅が大好きです。Love は大好きという意味で使います。And I love it. そして、Because I get to travel all throughout the skies. 空の至るところに行けるので、ということですね。I get to travel all throughout the skies. そしてそれがお気に入りの一つです。こちら。Which is one of my favorite things to do. Which is one of my favorite things to do. Okay, let's review Debbie's reply one more time. Here it is. Well, I have a friend named Rose.、Um, she flies an airplane and she takes me on the grandest adventures, and I love it because I get to travel all throughout the skies, which is one of my favorite things to do. Okay, we saved the fastest one for last. 実はこれがネイティブのノーマルスピードです。さっきより少し聞き取れるようになりましたかということで、次は皆さんの番です。実際の友達でもあなたが思い描く理想の友達についてでも OK です。And maybe you can tell a joke. 二分以上が目標です。Are you ready? Here's the question. Tell me about one friend. Start. Okay, time's up. How did you do? スムーズに答えることはできましたかさて、せっかくですので、ここで僕とジェニーさんも挑戦してみます。Okay, first I'll ask Jenny. Tell me about one friend. Start. I have a good friend named Campbell. We've known each other a long time, and his birthday is the same day as my daughter's birthday. Okay, now it's my turn. Tell me about one friend. Ready, start. I have a friend named Jenny. She's very nice and beautiful. And she is always on the right page in our textbook. Jenny さんはいつも私より早く textbook の正しいページをパッと開いています。さて、皆さん自分なりにもう一度トライしてみてください。So, try to reply in your own words one more time. Here's the question Tell me about one friend. Start. Okay, great job, everyone. And great job on our skill test this week. それでは来月6月の学習テーマを紹介しましょう。Our theme for next month is Your Land, My Land。私の町はこんな町。地元を紹介するときに使える便利なフレーズを取り上げます。地元の地理や天気、有名なものを伝えられるようになりましょう。例えば、私の地元は何々で有名です。英語でどのように言いますかぴったりの表現がありますよ。So join us again next month. Okay, your speaking skills are getting better day by day. So, see you next time on A Kaiwa Time Trial. Bye bye. bye, -bye.